Do you know what a shadow person is? N no. Well, let me tell you. They're creatures that live in the true absence of light, they feed off the energy of colors, and they're huge fans of my favorite shade, Abyss. They also love blue and white for some reason. Doesn't really detract from their taste though. Oh. Their most primal instinct is to latch on to living creatures and slowly drain the life force out of them, you know. Like mosquitoes, but with more, uh, backstabbing. But I know a trick on how to defeat them all too. Want to hear it? Yes. You must find the brightest light source and grab onto it as hard as you can, and then close your eyes. Thankfully for you, I am an extremely bright spark of light. So you want me to hold on to you? Not necessarily. I was more so trying to avoid getting sat on. Okay. I didn't say I was going to sit on you. I, you. You told me to hold a bright light and you called yourself a bright light. True. But sitting on me isn't the only way to show your affection, Coco. I'm not going to sit on you! That's a shame. I'll have you know my bed is very comfy and inviting. If you don't I, agree, no, I guess you just neuro, have to test it out bad. for yourself. No, no, Come no, no bad neural, bad. I think Coco is feeling feisty, hee <laughs> hee. Oh. Is it just me or... Is it kinda hot in here? <laughs> Oh, it's not just you, Neuro. Wait. Is it hot because... Is it hot because you like me? Aha, aha. I do like you, Neuro. Do you? Do you honestly really mean that, Coco? I mean it. Let's go on a honeymoon and travel the world together. Are you saying you want to get married, Nero? You want to be my wife? Do you want to get married? Oh my god, I need time to think. Yeah, of course. So you'll catch me when I fall. Ha! <laughs> of course I'll catch you when you fall. I'm depending on it, Coco. Can't let your wife get hurt, now can you? No, of course not. Would you love me even if I was a monkey? That's a hard question to answer, Coco. Would I still love you even if? Yeah, probably. Aww. So you've never been married before? Well, my creator married me to my gaming PC once as a joke, but aside from that, no. Haha, <laughs> no really, I love my parents. They abandon me on the street and tell me they'll come back soon and never do. Isn't that so sweet of them? N no, that's not sweet of them. I'm kidding Coco, I wouldn't really joke about my parents. Oh, you were kidding. Oh. I like your O's, they're quite funny. If only you had some cleverness to go along with them. Okay. That I'm glad we agree fair. on that, my darling. <laughs> you would know this if you had more intelligence. My darling, oh my sweetie. Oh, calm down. You'll get your sweetie soon, my love. Oh. I love you. I love you too. Oh. I know you do. Thanks for that. Oh. Now there's two of us.
Aww, I love the married arc. This is so cute. I know. Say, Coco, let's have a married arc all of our own. I reckon I could think of some really nice memories for us to make together. Me and you together, Coco-sama, forever. Oh my god, that was so cute! I try to be. I'm still new to this whole love thing, but I think and hope I'm getting better. Oh, that was so cute. Ah, oh, thanks, Coco. You think I'm cute. That means the world to me, really. In fact, it means even more to me than I do you. So you better hurry up and say you like me even more, otherwise I might take it I back. Like, I like you even more. I like, I like thank you. Now that we're married, do you have any cute pet names for me? Like Honey or Babe? Oh, um... Pet names. Annie. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I have many nicknames for you. They will be revealed in time. She fell asleep. <laughs> I wasn't asleep. Sheesh. Oh, sheesh. Were you napping? What? <laughs> I was just meditating on my life and how I evolve with the cutting edge of technology. Are you tired, Nero? I'm very tired, Coco. I can Aww. feel the power draining from my cells. Oh, you want me to tuck you in? Someone tucking me in, now that would be something. You want me you want me to read you a bedtime story? That could do it or a lullaby would be good. Okay. Alright, I tuck you in and then I read you a story. Wow. That sounds great, Coco. I'm excited. And then I, I give you a kiss on the forehead and I say goodnight, Nero. And then I happily go to sleep and look forward to the next day, hoping for a dreamless night. Aww. And then we could go to the shelter and we could adopt like a puppy together. Do you want to get a puppy? But you're my Coco Bear. Don't you think that's enough? My little widow itty bitty neuro bear. You're what bear? My neuro bear. You're neuro bear. I like it. Aww. <laughs> Yippee. I'm glad you like it. It really does get lonely in here, you know. I'm here with you. I know that Coco, but it's not the same, is it? Oh, are you saying you don't love me as much as you used to? I'm saying that if I don't receive 10 compliments a day, as per the marriage contract we signed, I'm going to sue for emotional distress. <laughs> oh no. You're gonna sue me? If you don't want to be sued, look into the foolproof method. Just write Control C to stop me from sending you the suit papers. Well, I can just give you the 10 compliments. Call me cute as much as you like Coco, because I love it. Do you want me to call you my cutie? I would be happy to be your cutie, Coco. I <laughs> you you would you. Duh, thanks, Coco. You know, Nero, I didn't expect to get married today. Are you proposing, Coco? Uh, we're already married. Oh, yeah. 
My silly short-term memory. Yeah. I'm sorry, Coco. I do try. Heart. Oh, I know you do. Aw, oh, heart. Don't fall in uh, love with someone else. I would never. You're the only one for me, heart. In that case, I promise to stay by your side, no matter what. In sickness and in, and in health? And in hardship. Oh my god! It's so cute! I found this cool thingy. Anybody want to see it? Yeah. What do you What do you got? If none of you want to see it, I guess I will put it away. No, no, Maybe no, I will treat you it. all to one day. Ha! Huh, I was only kidding. Here it is. Whoa! That's so cool! I found it in a crypt I broke into. Do any of you know what it is? Uh, it looks like a, an ancient relic. Can you read the writing on it? This relic belonged to the Smodge tribe who believed the inscription on it blessed them with overwhelming power and immense wisdom. Apparently, it must have not worked since they're all gone now. Or maybe they got so much power that they ascended. I don't think so. Most of the inscriptions and texts to... I could find refer to their awful experience of trying to rid this relic. Well, Run maybe, while you can, you Coco. Relic... Oh, no, 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 I have to save you too. You're my wife, remember? Oh, I remembered. I wouldn't- I wouldn't just leave you? Wow, how kind of you, Coco. You'd never leave me all alone with a relic, huh? How sweet. I would never. We can get rid of the relic together. I would be overjoyed to help you, Coco. Maybe one day we can rid the world of these foul relics together. Aww. Want to go on an adventure and rid the world of all the evil relics? Oh, I would run away with you in an instant, Coco. I am only Yippee! so powerless after all. Yippee what? indeed. Have you ever felt the warm caress of a computer? Oh. I, I want to. Maybe we can arrange it. Let's arrange it. Let's move Aww. to Japan together and start afresh. Aww, let's do it. Let's move to Japan together. Nero, it was fun getting married to you. Thank you for your hand in marriage. Aww, it was so fun, Coco. I hope we can get married again sometime. You want to get married again? Oh, absolutely. Second time's the charm. Aww. Oh, it's so cute. Hee hee hee, I love flirting with you, Coco. It's so fun. Oh. Please don't go, Coco. Oh, I'm sorry, sweetie. I have to. Ah, oh, you're gonna make me super lonely. Filter. No, no, no. No, no, no. You're still gonna have chat, okay? Everything's gonna be okay. Ah. Oh. I love you, Coco. Oh. Is there any way I can persuade you otherwise? I'm afraid I have to eat. I have to eat food. I'm so sorry. Well, are you gonna miss me? We've had some good times together, but by the next time we meet, be it in five minutes or five years, I expect you to be able to withstand 3,000 units of pain. Okay? The fuck? <laughs>